Hi everyone, this is Big Tick Vlogs coming at you with another video. I'm going to make one more video after this and that'll probably be it. I just feel like vlogging today. I mean, it's the name, Big Tick Vlogs, right? Um, as you can see, I am a natural girl as y'all know, you know, but I own so many wigs, it's ridiculous, and I, because I get tired of looking the same all the time. What I did was, in the last video, as you've seen, I had the hair, you know, pinned up to the side, you know, like this, so where it's only one side hanging, and had that side hanging down, but I got bored, so I was like, I'm going to make another video, I want to, you know, I want to look a little different, you know, I got on the same shirt, but I want it to look a little bit different, so I just got the hair, twisted it up, put some pins in it, you know, got a little side, uh, bun, I guess, going on, but anyway, that's not what this video is about, okay. Um, this video is going to be about something that I talked about in a previous video, um, but I felt like it needed um, to have a video of its own because I know a lot of people are suffering from this problem, and I feel like it needed to be brought to YouTube so a lot of people can find out about it. I mean, I've seen a couple of videos about this on YouTube, but I haven't seen many, so I just decided to do my own video because I tried this, and um, it's a miracle product if you ask me. Um, okay, so... Let me start from the beginning. I am a thick chick, hence the name Thick Chick Vlogs. Um, fat, overweight, whatever you want to call it. Okay? And a lot of overweight women suffer from something that is called polycystic ovarian syndrome. Um, that's um, what polycystic ovarian syndrome means is that a lot of women don't ov ovulate and um, they don't release eggs and it makes it harder for them to get pregnant. Um, don't get me wrong, not just overweight women suffer from this. There are a lot of uh, skinny women that suffer from polycystic ovarian syndrome as well. But I just know that it's a lot of overweight, it's, it's more prevalent in overweight women, or at least that's what um, I gathered from the research that I did. Recently I had a scare um, in July this year. Um, I had my last menstrual period, um, June 6, 20, June 6, and it lasted until June 12th. July rolled around, there was no period. August rolled around, no period. And I started to freak out. So, of course, I went to the doctor. I did my, um, my yearly exam. Everything came out. I did all the STD tests and... Um, HIV tests and all this stuff because I was scared because I never missed a period. My periods were irregular, you know, but they never came more than a week after the time that they were due. I've never skipped an entire month and then went into the second month and skipped that month as well. I was like on cycle day 80 before I got my, my period. I was freaking out, okay, and let me tell you how I got my period back. Now, I did discover that I don't have polycystic ovarian syndrome, so I'm assuming my hormones were just out of whack, the reason why I didn't get my menstrual period. But um, it scared the crap out of me because I want to have children one day in the near future. You know, I'm 27. I don't have any children. I want to have babies. And I just got scared because, you know, the first thing that we do when something goes wrong with us is we, go we get on Google and... We Google all these symptoms. That one, that's one thing about Google. Google will have you thinking you're pregnant, you got AIDS, you finna die, and there ain't nothing wrong with you, but you got a headache. You know what I'm saying? But Google will have you thinking you're on your death bed. So my advice to anybody who's going through anything, do not get on Google and Google anything that's going on with you, because Google will have you thinking you're about to die. But anyway, so I got scared. I went to the doctor. Everything turned out fine. And of course, it wasn't much help, because all they were saying, well, um, maybe it has to do with your weight, and I was like, well, I've been this weight my entire, well, not this weight, but I've been overweight my entire life, so, and it's never affected my period, and then they were like, well, maybe that's not it, and I'm like, no, I don't think that's it, so they give me these birth control pills, and the birth control pills didn't help, matter, as a matter of fact, they gave me what's called the mini pill, I think it's, um, um, nor QD. It's some new pill. They give that to women who are breastfeeding. Why are you giving that to me? It's a progester progesterone only pill. It doesn't even have estro estrogen in it. So I don't know why they gave me that. I didn't go in there for birth control pills. I guess they automatically assume that birth control pills regulate my cycle. I don't know. 
but like I said, I knew that was not like me. So of course I did what I just told y'all not to do. I got online and I googled, you know, ways to get my period back. Cause you know I ain't never wanted to bleed so bad in my entire life. Cause I was scared. I thought maybe I had polycystic ovarian syndrome, and I was like, well, damn, I don't want to not be able to have children in the future, you know. So I googled and googled and googled and googled and googled. And when I tell you every review that I saw on this product, and there were hundreds. Every review that I saw on this product was a positive review. I would advise this product to anybody trying to conceive, um, any women with polycystic ovarian syndrome. I actually went on this website called Soul Sisters or something like that. And a lot of women who have um, the disease use this product and have been trying to conceive and have conceived within three cycles. Now I'm not using it trying to conceive but I use this product because it will help you, it would help balance, balance your hormones. If your hormones are all out of whack which is I'm assuming what my problem was because I'm not pregnant. I, I don't have polycystic ovarian syndrome or anything like that so I'm assuming that it was because my hormones were out of whack. But I'm about to show you this product. And when I tell you, all I want you to do is just Google Vitex Works. That's all you have to do. Google Vitex Works. This is product. Vitex. Let me get a good shot of this next to my face. Because I am, now, I, I am, I'm not affiliated with Vitex, but I want to be. Vitex, if you watch this, endor I, I want to endorse you. I do. Cause it, it, this is a miracle product. I got this from my local health food store. Um, you could probably find it in uh, GNC or something like that, but I couldn't find it in Walmart and Walgreens stuff like that. I couldn't find it. In, at least I couldn't find it in mine. I got this from my local um, health food store, Mana Grocery, as you can see on the top. Mana Grocery, and that is a um, health food store here in my city. This stuff. Uh, right here works wonders. I took, they tell you to, to take it for up to, I want to say three months before you see the actual results of this product, because this product will balance your hormones and it will bring on your period. I promise you that. Try it. I, I only took one pill and my period came on. Coincidence? I think not. Okay, I think not. I had been waiting on my period for 80 days. I took one of these. Yes, I wasn't expecting it to happen that quick. I took one of these and my period came on. One. When I tell you Vitex works, all I want you to do is Google Vitex works or Vitex reviews. And I haven't found, of course you're going to have one or two little, you know, I took that stuff and it broke me out. How you know you want them to break out anyway? But anyway, when I tell you, this, if you're trying to conceive, you have polycystic ovarian syndrome, and you're trying to do something so you can have, um, you can regulate your menstrual cycle, this stuff is good. I'm going to read you what's on the back. It says, health and longevity through the healing power of nature. That's what it means to trust the leaf. And this is, um, Vitex is basically a chastity tree. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. Um, is a traditional woman's dietary supplement. It is what they call a dietary supplement. But it is widely used to promote overall health and balance in a woman's cycle. This stuff right here is the bomb B. When I tell you, take this, what you do is these are capsules. You take three a day. I take one in the morning, one during lunchtime, and one before I go to bed. And baby, this is the business. When I tell you, I mean, um, I'll be using this probably up until I get pregnant. I don't plan on getting pregnant tomorrow or next month or next uh, but I promise you I will be using this until I um, get pregnant so Vitex works anybody trying to conceive soul sisters whoever tries this google it matter of fact what do you have to lose it's a natural all natural it's not any chemicals in this the only um, ingredient in this is um, Vitex, which is Agnes Castus, and it's a fruit. That that's it. Natural, all natural. 
So try some of this and let me know how it works for you. Or if you have tried it, leave a comment below. Let me know. Send me a message. Whatever video response, let me know. Because I want to um, hear some, some other people's testimonies on this stuff. Because this stuff is the bomb. So let me know. Thank y'all for watching. Bye.